Get a girl, 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 get a girl. Hey, 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 go mommy, go, go, go mommy, go. Hey you guys. Hi. So we're back again. Week, Week two. two. All right. Show you guys some exercises. And then also gonna show you some of the things that we did over the past week. Yes. Yeah. In terms of like, uh, I went downtown Toronto and I mean, cooking with mom, you'll see, you'll see. It'll, it'll be fun. Hi guys. Just showing you um, a little bit of our grocery haul that we did for this week. So fruits, lots of fruits and vegetables, kale. So you can see for yourself, cabbage, pumpkin, squash, squash we call this one, and uh, avocado, sweet peppers, you know, and then I'm gonna also make some Beans, kidney beans, we call it red peas from Jamaica, you know? In Jamaica, we call it red peas, so yeah, kidney beans. Time for the whole work. Pomegranate, pomegranate, and um, organic Granny Smith apple. Yes, cauliflower, celery, carrots, plum, spinach, mushrooms, healthy stuff, you know, we're trying. All right, hey you guys. Hey guys. So we're going for a walk. Yep. Sabbath afternoon. Yep. Last day of October. Mm -hmm.
Look on this crazy person. It is Halloween, October 31st. And this man is really in the water like it's not cold out here. Keep in mind how my mom is dressed and how I'm dressed. You can see her glasses, like one of the, the lenses are fogged up. So this man is absolutely... so beautiful out here if it wasn't cloudy the sunset would be even more magnificent bring it
Lake Ontario, by the way. We didn't introduce that earlier. The wind is kicking right now. It's freezing. Yeah. No joke about it. It is really, really cold. And it's like near a cliff, so we ain't going too close. <laughs> but yeah, it is, it is really, really nice out here. Oh, look at this cute little house. It looks like a cabin. Oh, people. Oh, I like this too. When people carve their names into the trees and stuff like that. That's pretty neat. Dusty men living down here. Ciao. In 200 meters, your destination will be on the right. Alright, nice and colorful. Ooh, look at this. I love to see this. Yeah, boo. Black Lives Matter. And protect all our workers. Yes, yes. And it don't stop to the beat and it don't stop yes yes and it don't stop to the beat and it don't stop so yeah right now we are downtown hey y'all yes we are walking downtown see we live in the burbs so i don't get to come downtown very often especially since the pandemic started so this is a nice little treat mm. street car mm -hmm. all right and we are at our destination oh, to the right is <laughs> And we're back on the road. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. How do y'all feel about one-way streets? Let me know in the comments. <clears throat> I'm not a fan of one-way streets at all. So annoying. Especially when you don't know the area, you like, oh crap, you start to panic. Yeah, not fun. In 400 meters, use the right two lanes to turn slightly right onto Richmond Street East. Check out the CN Tower, you guys. CN Tower. Oh boy. Use the right two lanes to turn slightly right onto Richmond Street East. Continue on Richmond Street East for three kilometers. It's so crazy to be down here and there's like virtually no traffic. The pandemic has really changed things up, man. Like really, really and truly. Normally we'd be in like back-to-back -back traffic right here. It's crazy. So beautiful down here though. Yay, we made it. 
okay, so we're at what you call the, well, what I call, and local Torontonians, we call the Sky Dome. They've changed the name to Rogers Center, but when you grow up calling a place a certain name, that is what it is. It will always be Sky Dome to me. Okay? Point blank, period. Period! <laughs> So this is the neighborhood in which I grew up, yes. My bestie used to live right there. There's a mall across the street. And this is the exact building that I grew up in. 1059 Don Mills, baby, yeah. Yeah, now they call that mall shops at Don Mills. It's all fancy and stuff. Boutique shops and all that. All that jazz. My old stomping ground. It feels good to be home. Yes, yes. Some other day I'll come back and give you guys a whole tour of the area. It'll be nice. I'll probably dedicate like a whole vlog to that. So, yeah. And I'm going to bring mommy too so she can tell stories of the area. Because we left here when I was eight, so obviously there's some stuff I don't remember. And some stuff that occurred before I was even born. Because she's been living in this neighborhood since 1986. So really, really long time. From 86 to 2001. So she knows the area well. So yeah, we're going to get some stories from her. So that'll, that will be fun. Oh, and the high school I almost went to. But of course, as I said... We moved when I was eight. The high school is right there. You can see like the yard. I see some picking out there. A little pitney, pitney, pitney. They're playing basketball. Oh, this is the middle school side. Yeah, those kids definitely are high schoolers. So it's a collegiate, so it's split in half. So half of the school is middle school, the other half is a high school. Yup, there's it. They are social distancing as well. Good job, kitties. Proud of Ono. Pat yourselves on the back. All right, time to head home. Back to the burbs.